Hello everyone, this is Captain Cat. I'm going to be playing Dark Days, and I'm going to show you guys how to get guns and, of course, ammunition. Uh, sorry, armor uh, for your daily runs. So uh, we're going to the silo, and I have said this so many times: the silo is one of the best areas you actually get that. And what I'm going to show you guys is that you don't have to go around with big armor like this when you're doing it. You can do it on low armor as well. But I'm just taking some of this with me because it's going to be used anyway. And these are just the weapons. Why I'm going to do it with the zip gun and these low weapons here is because I'm going to show you guys that we're capable of upgrading uh, quite fast and very cheap. So it's what it's all about is getting uh, the armor and the guns for that. Um, there's been no update lately. It's been the latest update that had been on uh, Dark Days. It's actually uh, only bug fix and some changes in the animations. So when you're actually shooting someone, it's more bloody. It's actually looking pretty cool. Remember guys, every time there's an update, you need to go into control settings right here, control settings, and pressing auto uh, reload. Why you want to do that is because it's going to reload on automatically, plus it's going to auto shoot. I always have these two on. That's why I'm hitting uh, zombies uh, on auto, if you can say it like that. It's actually easier for me to navigate around it. If I wanted to make a sneak attack, or I don't want to have it not on, but I'm never actually using that, so. Um, you can do these particular runs actually without any weapons if you have enough healing. I'm not going to show you guys that because I think it's a waste of time doing that. I rather want to have this simple club with me and it's actually uh, the upgraded club itself. And it just needs some duct tape and some wood and I think it's... Uh, I can't actually remember. Let's just see this. Uh, it's actually one of the cheapest ones. Right here, it's just some duct tape and some wood. So everyone can do this and you can get the duct tape in the green area as well. Uh, the first one we're going to get is, of course, the one we're going to shoot here. Uh, where is, why is that not like that, like this? Perfect. Um, so we're going to shoot this one. This is actually the one, the only one we're going to fight against. These two right here, and maybe one more. I don't know. Let's just see. Otherwise, we're just going to go like this. If you're moving around like that, it's normally never going to hit you. But you never know. Oh my god, there's... These guys there, you don't want to fight them. And then we're going to lure this dude here. Now the great thing right here, you can see in this particular one, it's going to upload in different ways. Uh, the zombies on in the middle right there, they're uploading in different uh, combination. And this time it's actually quite, quite easy because the biggest chest is on this side over there. And there's the big one, but we're going to outrun him. And I'm going to show you guys how we're going to do that. And the other one we're going to kill and kill in this area with the chest right here. This is one of the main chests that we're going to use every time and trap them right here. They have placed it like this so that we're incapable of trapping them. That's a good thing. And we do like the developers for doing that. So thank you guys for that. And if you want some helicopter fuel here, you can have that. But remember, guys, uh, the main problem right here is with the helicopter uh, itself is that it's not uh, available yet so they actually t took it away so that we're not facing any irritation that we are not incapable of getting it so let's just lure out this dude here just a second we only want this dude on our tail like this so we're gonna shoot him do we get the tension here only this one please yeah thank you okay now we're gonna go to this area holy shit he's fast Today he just took on his right shoe, so that's a good thing. Damn it, we're running around. We didn't want to do that. I don't know why I did that. Okay, so let's just see. We're going inside of here and going out like that. And then he's stuck like this. Now we're incapable of doing headshot, but we're also incapable of actually going toward this dude with this club here. And we're easily going to kill him without getting hit. Remember, have a distant. You can see the distant meter itself appears sometimes. And I can't say how low, how far we need to go, but we need to look up here, I think it is, and then we get a headshot. Sometimes you need to turn around. That's actually a funny part. Now there's a headshot by turning around, you can see, like this. This is the area where we want to stand and hit the dude with headshot every time. So uh, it's, it's pretty funny that they had done that, but this is actually the hit when he hits back, that's going to hit him. But 80, uh, 28 actually is a good hit range every time, so 
And the great thing with this new update uh, that they made last time, actually, is that it's going to automatically take on the next weapon in the road. And the next weapon is, of course, my zip gun. I do hope that this dude's going to die before this. Uh, we're going to move it a little. Okay. There we go. Uh, that was definitely not it. There we are. Yeah. And the recording just up. Sorry about that. We're just going back in. Um, I don't know how much you guys saw, but actually going in and out like that. I, I think it's because it actually went in and out. Um, and no particular reason why it did that. That's why the recording stopped. So let's just see. Uh, I killed the guy uh, using the club, so I don't have much back for that, actually. All I have, as you can see, I have the sip gun and the club back. So these are the two things that I have back. It's actually not much, but I killed the dude, and the great thing, he's not going to spawn back, even though we go in and out. So now he's just lying there, waiting for me to loot him. Okay, we did loot that last time. Okay, and the dude is at this point right here. Here we go. Oh, we got a break. That's a good thing. And one more sip gun. I didn't actually see that. Oh, that's a low sip gun. The ability. Uh, it's funny when they actually lie around with those kind of weapons. I think the, the developer needs to look at some of the, the weapon drops right here because it's actually taking a long time. This is the first weapon that we get. It's, of course, just a sip gun, but still... It's okay. So let's just see. We keep on going here. I'm going to nail these dudes over there so you guys can see how we're going to do that. One more gun here. I'm going to check everything. Throw that away. Like this. Throw that away. Something like that. Okay. So that's two sip guns. One. They are not the one we want. We rather want the clubs. So and one more sip gun. This one is 30 smackers. Every time you need to take something, definitely going to take that. So. Okay, uh, like this, I think. Uh, do we have any shoes here, guys? I think we had a pair of shoes here. If we just take all, it will just automatically put it on. That's a good thing. Okay, now the main problem is we're going to destroy these two guys, but we're going to go around this area. Uh, we're going to go around here, so we're going to kill these first. Okay, like that. And um, then we're gonna take out this dude first. Yeah, and do it. That's definitely the worst part when we're doing something like that. These guys are not getting stuck as easily. Plus, they're gaining life, and I do hate that. Come on, die, please die before this dude is coming. Come on, two more hits. Come on. What is the odds for this? Come on, hit shit. Why am I not doing that? I like that. Holy shit, that's a perfect hit. Okay, now we're incapable of killing this dude, but we're not gonna do that. We rather wanna do something else. We can make him stuck. Uh, and how to do that is actually quite simple. <laughs> we need to do kill this dude first with headshots as well. You can just now you're incapable of running around in a circle, and that's the funny part. You can see he's stuck right now. That's a good thing. But we're gonna interfere with this dude just in a while. Oh my god. This is going very good right now. Holy shit, he's too close to me. And that's fucking irritating. Just a second, guys. I need to roll away from this dude. Where is my shoe? Did I lose them or something? Okay. And this is why you want to have enough 
armor, not just armor, but enough of run areas to run around at. Because you don't want to have the big one to come and interfere in this particular fight. You rather want to kill this one first and then take out the other one. And remember, you, come on, hit it like that, perfect. Uh, you don't need to actually take him out. You just need to lure him inside of this area right here. Come on, duty. Come on, you fat monster. The Cyclob itself is easily. Uh, just need to let him stay like that. And he's going to be just standing there thinking, Oh no, he's gone. Oh my god, he didn't stop. Oh, he stopped. But then he stopped moving again. That was a stupid move. Are we gonna get him stuck in this area instead? Normally he's gonna get stuck right here in this point here. Okay. Uh, then we're gonna sneak to it. We're not in capable of sneaking. Oh my god, come on, dude. Run this area right here. You wanna stay in this area? I wanna get him stuck right here, actually. I think around this area there. That's going to be a good area. So let's just hope. That this dude's going to get stuck. He's stuck right now. That's a good thing. Uh, here we have the first one. Plus, we got some extra good things here, guys. Remember, some of these loops here are actually going to make you capable of making better weapons. He's going to get stuck there. Don't worry about that. And let's, oh damn it! We're going to take everything instead. Holy shit! He didn't get stuck. That's such a lie, I said. Okay, we just need to take away something here. Please get stuck. Uh, like that. And we're going to make... Did it crash or what? Okay, like that. Perfect. What else are we going to throw away here, guys? We're going to do this. Okay, we need some space, that's why, and we need to do it quite fast. Take all. And move the fuck away. Perfect. Now, this is just how I'm doing it. You can run back and forth in this area every 24 hours. You can keep doing this. And as you can see right here, I actually got some armor. Plus, I got that. These are the main chest with the main prizes. The other one that's going to be actually pretty easy for you to get is this one right here. I'm just going to show you guys this. I uh, just need some weapons. Like that. Now you might think, why is he not killing the Cyclops? This is not coming. He's not our f that difficult to actually manner it. Managed to get away from. Holy shit, we're not getting through that. Why are these guys upgraded? Ah, now we've lost our clothes. That's so embarrassing. Now this is the area you want to stay and hopefully the dude with that is going to throw rocks not gonna come and if the cyclops is coming you're definitely gonna die guys uh, you just need to do something you just need to run there's no way out if the cyclops he has two big hands he's in capable of taking it down if you want to make it more safe you do this area before you go into the middle um, I actually didn't think I wanted to do this, but I just want to show you guys that you're capable of getting even more armor and even more prizes. These are the two extra chests that are actually getting okay drops. Of course, every chest in this area is giving okay drops, but the main in the middle are the best. So let's just take on some of this. We are actually, you can see we have, okay, right here, this are the main prizes that I do like. Plus the zip guns are also for free if you can see it like that so let's just take this one and then the rear looting the next chest over there 
more things here, perfect. Take off, this one right here is giving you 50 smackers, so of course you want to take that. Uh, I think it's like this, I don't know. And of course there's a lot of tools that if you're new at this particular game, you rather want to take those things, but I don't need them, so you're going to use them for upgrading. Uh, I don't need that, right, I want a beef, and that's so perfect. So this is how I look right now, it's actually okay, I got an upgrade on this one, I got a new helmet, plus two new, uh, there's a full set here almost, uh, I just need the boots, you're incapable of getting that, plus I got these items right here, this one I had, and of course this one right here, I didn't have, so... That's all for me for now. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm Kepi Cat, and of course, subscribe to my channel, give this video a like, and as always, guys, have fun. This guy is stuck in the wall. That's perfect. Perfect glitch. I do like that. Uh, the developers are coming up with new updates every time. I do hope that they will make more than just bug fix every time. I do hope that we will soon get even better loots, and of course, more new areas. That would be great. Hopefully, these guys will see this video. I'm actually going to upload it on their site, so I hope you guys enjoyed this. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.